isolation. It's the one gift from the good Lord most people do not want. But if you think about it, we've lived in sustained stress and uncertain ambiguity for over a year, and we've done it alone. During the 2020 COVID-19 global pandemic, our entire civilization has been in isolation. We see its effects daily in nursing homes and ER wards, unemployment lines, and on our bank statements, and most sadly, newspaper obituaries. Ours is what C.S. Lewis called a grief observed. But uniquely, this grief is being experienced in isolation, all alone. The social distancing, self-isolation, quarantine, the hygiene protocols have not stopped the decimation brought upon our communities, our churches, our businesses, and our metropolitan areas. This book, Jesus in Isolation, is your invitation to join Jesus, to find Jesus where sickness, death, grief, and isolation take center stage. Perhaps no other story in the life of Jesus speaks to our COVID-19 world like this one does. Unimaginable moments of grief lie ahead for every one of us. It's an unavoidable part of Christian living. But that said, we as Christians need to live in that space well as the world observes our isolation and our grief. We live in that space also knowing that in Jesus, our grief has been more than observed, it's been absorbed into himself. Jesus is the hero of our story, and only through him do we discover a sense of healing and of hope. May this book, Jesus in Isolation, give you the hero you've been searching for, the only one truly worthy of hero worship. God bless.